that's Nate G. Bailey, and welcome back to Let's Play Bravely Default. Since last time, we fully developed Narendi. Got all the shops up to max there, level 11. Not that it was anything extraordinary, but we don't need to worry about that anymore. And I also checked out the mammons that I've been getting as nemeses, and I checked it out. This one is indeed the one that I was looking for. Although I did find another Japanese one that did, was not the right one. But this is the right one that you guys were telling me about, that you could steal elixirs from her. And with Rob Blind, I could get two at a time, and they sell for, I think, 25 grand a piece. So that's pretty nice. Not that it's especially important anymore because I already have all the money I'll ever need, but it's there. But all right, so that's everything with Narende there. Uh, huh, no party chat? Hmm. Well, anyway, uh, since last time I've rearranged my party as I have listed in the video description, the only major change really is making sure I get paralyzed immunity on everyone there. But otherwise, yeah, we're looking pretty good there. Let's see. We got a Lambent hat on Adia there, but the others, uh, yeah, I need the red caps to help boost their agility. Uh, let's see. How are we looking on, uh, MP? Okay, yeah, we're all at full. Let me see if I leave the screen. Do I need to do that to, uh, yeah, there we go. Well, not really restored. We just created another village and called it Narende. Well, at least we got Eggle helping out. Not that we can actually visit the town of Narende, other than what we got in the map menu and all that. Aww. Yeah, we still got that big hole in the ground where the original Narende used to be. Oh, well, yeah. It took me 40 hours into the game to get that done, finally. Yeah, usually I get Narende fully developed by the time I'm done with Chapter 4. We're getting there, though. We've still got quite a few things that we can do, besides advancing the main plot. Aww. Well, you already had one person. Well, one thing I could do, though, with uh, Narende, with uh, the Mammon boss there, I could use those elixirs that I could steal and buy costumes with them. So that way everyone doesn't look completely ridiculous in all the cutscenes in whatever job class they're in at the time. But, eh, I'll think about what I want to do with the costumes, but you're willing, you're, you're welcome to chime in on that too, viewers. But all right, we're done here, so let's go look at, or try to find another one of those keystones. Let's see, let's go to Southmore. Although Starkfort might be a little closer, technically. Mm, yeah, this is a little closer. But yeah, we got this little area over here that we could have come to way earlier in the game, but I decided that, yeah, it wasn't... Well, there's no r real reason to come here before visiting Vampire Castle, because we couldn't have done anything here, but now we can! Like boss time! Here it comes! Against Ladon, or Ladon, or however you want to pronounce it, I don't know. But, okay, so this guy being the Earth Elemental Dragon is weak to win. Unfortunately, I can't really exploit that very well with Agnes or Ring a Bell or Tiz because I don't have any wind elemental weapons and we can't use that with uh, sword magic there. So we're just going to have to inflict our own elemental weakness on the guy eventually. But alright, let's see. Okay, so let's start with getting Rampart all set. Now, I don't want Agnes to 
go on the offense from the very beginning here because I can't exploit that elemental weakness. So I want to build up her BP until such time that I can exploit an elemental weakness there. But alright, let's see. Okay, so you got hit, but yeah, I'm not really worried about that. Ow. Yeah, you see, uh, that would have paralyzed your party members if you weren't careful there. But now I do need to uh, heal up, ring a bell. So yeah, let's do a little bit of healing there and get Rampart going. And we're not out of the woods yet. You can still just start spamming the Earth or Megaton Press or whatever that was, that attack was. But, eh, we're looking okay. But, okay, so now we got up to max BP for Tiz there. So let's see if we can steal some of those Dragon Fangs again. Uh, let's see, yeah, why don't we just default for now? Yeah, we're good. I don't care about Earth Week, but I do care about... Getting, or building up some BP for Ring Bell. Man, I just can't get ahead in this battle. I mean, at least I'm not dying. Nice. Okay, well, we've still got one more to go, but, well, yeah, Adia is pretty busy at this point. So, how about we use Withering Ripple to inflict the elemental weakness and then Triple Thundaga against the guy there? I don't even care about the stat debuffs from withering ripple there all i care about is getting lightning weak on him so that way i can exploit that unfortunately i have not worked on white magic enough to have eroga or to be able to use it so i'm better off just inflicting an elemental weakness for lightning and then taking advantage of that with thundaga which i have built up already at this point but i would like to master black mage by the end of the chapter, which is part of why I've been focusing on it so much more, even though I don't even have level 6 black magic yet. Okay, so we're going to need to get the spell on Adia, but that's fine. Let's see. Yeah, get rid of that Earth Week so she can survive. And, hmm. You know what? Let's start building up her BP a little bit, so that way... When Lightning Week wears off the guy, she'll be able to, well, re-inflict it on the guy if we need to. But it looks like for now, we're just going to have to keep on sticking to dispelling Earth Week, but that's fine. Hmm, okay, let's see. Yeah, we're still good there, so why don't we get Thundaga going there? And, okay, we still got Lightning Week. Hmm. Yeah, I'm going to need you to default there without... Uh, Rampart protecting her. Hey, hey, all right. Okay, yeah, now we need to uh, get some other things going. Okay, let's get Rampart going on everyone now. And let's see. Okay, we still got Lightning Week for now. So let's see, let's give... Hold on. Okay, let's go with... One more on Ring a Bell, and then, yeah, we'll go double Fullman Shard, but I don't want to spend all of my spare BP on Adia, because I have a feeling Lightning Week is going to wear off any minute now. But we'll see how things go. Okay, yep. Saw that one coming. Okay, let's, uh, well, now that Lightning Week is gone, though, there's no point in attacking with her. So, okay, let's go Rampart. Then we'll get one more BP on Ring a Bell, and then I will re-inflict uh, Lightning Week on the guy. Oh, I forgot to buy more Fulman Shards. Well, I think I'll be fine anyway, but yeah, I should have uh, remembered that. Whoops. Well, I'm not really worried about that status. I thought I already had that inflicted on me, but apparently the boss doesn't really care. But, alright. Stupid dragon. Okay, yeah, let's uh, keep building up the BP there for Ring of Bell so I have the spare. How are we looking on HP? Ooh, we've got a long way to go. <laughs> yeah, 
these last three dragons are pretty tough because it's hard to exploit their innate elemental weaknesses with our given or our current um, equipment availability and spells and all that stuff. If you waited until the next chapter, then we might be able to do something with that, but I have patience problems, so I figured let's do it now. Okay, so now I'm using the Raikiri there in order to exploit the elemental weakness, and it also has a higher crit rate, so I might be able to deal some pretty good damage with God Speed Strike there. Otherwise, yeah, let's keep going with Fundaga there. Oh, uh, Tiz, I can't have him do that right now. Hmm. Yeah, hold on, Tiz. Uh, <laughs> thinking too far ahead there. Whoops. Okay, let's, uh, yeah, spell Earth Week there. And then, let's see, yeah, let's go with Giant Slayer there. We still got Lightning Week going, but I do want to build up a little more BP with Adia there. Unfortunately, I have no way of protecting against uh, Megaton Press there, as far as, like, a shield goes or anything like that. And we have no wind elemental weapons, even though Gale Bow, you might think that should be a wind elemental weapon, but it's not. Not in this game. So we'll just have to take what we can get. I just use the Dark Shield just because it has the best stats of what I have available at this point. Let's see, is Lightning Week still good? Awesome. And then, let's see, yeah, we're gonna need to get Rampart going again. So this is why I'm building up some BP, even for a Dia at this point, so that way once Lightning Week does wear off, she'll be able to handle that and potentially boost Ring of Bell's BP at the same time. Not bad, at least we got uh, Rampart going here. Okay, so yeah, why don't we just keep going with Thundaga? I'm gonna need to keep. Oh, no, the Lightning Week wore off. Okay, so we'll just uh, build that up then. But uh, yeah, let's get that going again. And yeah, we're good on BP otherwise, though. So. Uh oh. Tis could die because I can't uh, have him default at this point, so, hmm. Well, we'll see what we can do. I mean, I'm still going to dispel Earth Week to give him the best possible chance of survival, but it's not looking good. I suppose I could use Rampart at this point, but I think I'd rather just go on the offense a little bit. Once I get him down to, like, 50,000 HP, then I'll be able to go more on the offense there. But let's see, how are we looking here? Let's see, okay, let's go, let's restore some of Agnes's MP while I still can, or while I have the free time. Ooh, getting there. Ow. Okay, hmm. Well, I could use Cura on Tiz, but that probably wouldn't work too well. Hmm. Okay, I know what I can do. Oh, uh, well, I'll get back to that in a minute, but I do need to restore Tiz's HP, so let's go with, yeah, an X potion there. And, yeah, why don't we have you go on the offense? And someone was asking me, H.C. Bailey, is the reason why the X potion compound restores more HP than the actual X potion because of attack item amp, and no, that has no effect on it at all. It, it only has to do with the, the fact that it's a compound. Attack item amp only works with, well, attack items. So, yeah, that's not it there. But, okay, we're looking pretty good. We still got Rampart going. Almost got the guy's HP down as low as I need. Uh, let's see. Okay, so let's go with, yeah, Triple Giant Slayer. And, yeah, let's start thinking about wrapping things up here. Hmm. Lightning Week could wear off at this point. Hmm. 
Okay, how about we do this? We'll just use the one. I want to be very careful towards the end of the fight here. Don't want to lose everything that I've worked so hard to build here. Yeah, I think I saw him deal like 9,000 damage there in one of those hits. Okay, hmm. Okay, yeah, now we can, uh, er, yep, it wore off. Worst possible time. Hmm. Okay, how about we do this? We'll get that going. Thundaga, Magic Sword also wore off. Is everything wearing off at the same time? Everything, all at once. Holy cow. Okay, well, we'll get it in the next one. Okay, I'm not even going to bother with um, with getting haste on Tiz there. Let's just go double god... No. Double god speed strike. There we go. Get a whole bunch of uh, Thundagas going. I did get lightning link, right? Okay, good. Then, let's see. Giant slayers. And for a second there, I thought I was running a bit light on MP there, but no, we'll be okay. And I only have enough Fulman shards for three more of these, but that should be more than enough. I just hope that we're fast here. Haha! -ha! Yeah, I played it a little conservatively towards the end, but we're okay. Got the, uh... Dragon Fangs, there. You won. You have defeated my guardian. Very well. I shall grant you the Earth Keystone. I like that they actually re-record some of these lines, even though most of the words are the same, but you can tell, like, the inflections of Lord DeRoso's voice are di slightly different from one to the other. All right. Two more to go. As opposed to the Mithril Mine, where they just reused the same lines with Tiz over and over and over again. But, alright, we're good to go. Yeah, let's, uh... Yeah, we need to restock, because, yeah, all the remaining dragons that we gotta fight, their innate weakness is difficult to exploit. So, yeah, we need to make sure we've got plenty of Fulman charms. To take advantage of that. Well, at least I didn't lose too much by not restocking on them early. But let's see. Yeah, why don't we get up to like 40 or so? That ought to be good enough for now. And let's see. I need to change my setup just a little bit. Not too much. Let's see. The next dragon can inflict blind on the party, which I don't really care, except for Tiz and. Ring a bell there. No, Rob Blind will not help with that. Let's see. I think the Monk job class has... Yeah, yeah, Monk has Blind immunity there. But I don't care about that for Idea there, so... Mm. We'll deal with it when the time comes. But as it is right now, yeah, we can afford to boost our speed a little bit more there. And let's see, with Idea. Yeah, let's uh, get back on BP recovery. That ought to make things a little easier for her. But otherwise, the abilities will remain the same. Same thing with the shields there. I could equip more Lambent Hats on my party members. Like, I could do that with Anyas, but I barely have enough speed to guarantee acting before the bosses do. So I don't want to uh, put that at risk, even though I'm losing a little bit on damage, it's not a big deal there. But yeah, we're doing alright, especially with our uh, ether supply, I'd be a little concerned about that too, because I use so many of those for uh, compounding and stuff like that. Okay, let's see, so we've got two more continents left. Let's start with the Juliana Woods there. 
Although there was a, the other dragon, uh, Mizuchi, that was pretty close to here. But unfortunately, with this keystone, yeah, we had to... We had got, got to walk quite a ways to get there. But, well, so far we're doing pretty good with the dragons. I've only gotten, like, totally massacred at the start of the battle with the easiest dragon, ironically. For boss time! Here it comes! Against Shinryu, the Holy Dragon. Okay, so, yeah, just like the previous one, we can't exploit its innate elemental weakness, uh, in this case, uh, dark elemental attacks. So, let's see what we can do. Let's go double one more for you on Ring a Bell there. And, yeah, that ought to be good for now. Well, at least I can use BP recovery to stay on top of things this time around with uh, Dragon Breath, because I don't really care about flying. Okay, so let's keep going with uh, getting Rampart going. Well, at least I don't have to go too far into negative BP now. Yeah, normally that would be really bad without... Uh, BP recovery there, so... Yeah, that's pretty nice. Okay, let's, uh, yeah, keep building up ring -a bells BP. But now, now that I have enough extra, let's go inflict Lightning Week on the guy, so we can start taking advantage of that. I can't guarantee that Agnes will act after Adia, which is why I'm not having Agnes attack yet. Hey, hey, all right. Okay, so as usual, yeah, let's uh, get, examine the guy and get ready to steal. Let's see, I don't care about, uh, what was that, blind on my party members right now. So yeah, let's just go now to the Fundaga. Hmm, how are we looking here? Well, we've got Rampart on everyone. So yeah, now let's uh, get some other things going. I don't want to use all my excess BP, though, but enough of it. Okay, so we get one more for Ring a Bell, and then double Fulman Shard for the Pantheon's Wrath there. Now, eventually, I will want to cure Blind for Ring a Bell and Tiff. But not until they're ready to attack. And get one item from the guy? That is sad. Hmm. Well, we'll do the best we can. Hmm. Okay, you're gonna have to dispel yourself and hope that you don't get attacked again. Hmm. Let's see. Okay, yeah, let's go with Thundaga Magic Sword. How are you looking? Okay, still got Lightning Week going there. Hmm. So, yeah, let's just keep going uh, Pantheon. Grab there. Kind of odd stealing that particular item from the guy, but okay. Well, that didn't go as planned, but we'll see what we can do. Okay, yeah, just keep on going with that. Yeah, I suppose there is no light elemental battle item, so that's why we steal this one instead, I guess. But okay, let's go with Rampart. Let's see, I need to revive Anyas and get some BP for Ring a Bell there. So, where are you? Yeah, let's get a little more there. Oh, this guy, yeah, Lightning Week is still active. I'm paranoid about that wearing off sooner or later. Okay, and then... Yeah, then Pantheon's Wrath. And, yeah, that ought to be good. Well, at least the guy is giving me plenty of leeway with all the BP recovery I'm doing, but I still can't get the items from the guy. And Agnes could very easily die again, but we'll see what we can do. Okay, so now, let's see. Okay, now Lightning Week has worn off, finally. So, yeah, let's get that going again. 
I'd always like to leave Adia at zero BP at the end of a round. So that way I can get up to max if I get inflicted with another status ailment again. Or I could spend an extra DT to inflict Lightning Weak or whatever. Goodbye, Anyas! Nice. Well, maybe I should be using Rampart when I only have one party member who can stay alive. Or one party member who's inflicted with it. But, okay, let's see. Rebuild the BP there. Revive Agnes again. Hopefully, Adia will act before Ring a Bell, but probably not, knowing my luck. But we'll see what we can do. Do we still have. Okay, we got Lightning Weak going still. Okay, so now we can get Rampart. On Agnes again. Really, game? You really want her dead, don't you? I mean, seriously? Well, at least she doesn't have Earth or Light Week on her this time around. Uh, yeah. <sighs> okay. Well, goodbye, Anya. Can I get you into, like, positive BP for a change? Okay, so... Alright, I need you to get Dispel on yourself, although she would probably die anyway. But, yeah, I'm not going to use Rampart just for that. But I can get Giant Slayer going on the guy, so let's do that. And then, let's see... You know what, let's give an extra BP to Agnes there, so that way, if and when she dies, she won't be completely hosed on BP there. Because if she's in negative BP, I can't have her default when I revive her, or the round after I revive her. Oh, right, I forgot, we had uh, blind there. I'm so used to, like, never missing in this game, I just forget about that. But I do remember to get Rampart going. Okay, so, let's see, Lightning Week is also worn off there, so... Okay, let's build up ring a bells BP. Let's see, Revive Agnes. And... Reinflict. Lightning Week. Oop. Wow, I'm using a lot of Fulmin Shards this time because I can't get Agnes to actually contribute to the damage. Okay, how are we looking here? Yeah, we need to uh, get Rampart going again. Hmm, I wonder if Blind is affecting my ability to steal. I would think it shouldn't affect that, though. Hmm. But in any case, yeah, we might as well just start going on the offense there. Get Rampart going again. Let's see, where are we? No, actually, hold on. Let's just get one more BP for Ring of Bell there. That ought to be good enough for now. Well, this one's turning out to be more difficult than I thought it would be. Okay, I'm just going to cure Blind from Tiz, because that is really bothering me. Actually, no, wait a minute. I can have Adia do that. Yeah, you just keep going on the offense there. Yeah, because we got Lightning Weak. HP is starting to look good, but, well, we'll see when we get there. Okay, so let's get some more BP there, and let me see if I can do this correctly. Let's see if we got a potion and an eye drops. Yeah, you could cure blind and restore a little HP, but I don't need to do that. So let's just use just the eye drops by themselves. But that is another mixture you could use to fill out your compounding list there. And let's see. Okay, let's get... Where are they? 
Okay, Pantheon's Wrath Guy. I'm surprised you acted... Oh, wait, no. I was gonna say I'm surprised you acted before this, but I've got him as the freelance, so that's why. But hey, all right, we got the uh, Dragon Fangs there that I've been looking for all this time. Let's see, you're starting to get a little light on each or MP there for Anya, so I may want to start getting ready for that. Hmm. Although, yeah, we'll just go with the one there. But I do need to uh, get Rampart going again. Okay, so, yeah, let's get one more. A ring a bell. And, okay. Yeah, let's just go with a couple more Pantheon's Wraths there. Almost got the guy. Okay, let's see. I can get in one Godspeed Strike and a few hits from Ring of Bell, but he doesn't even have Thundaga Sword, not to mention the guy's no longer weak to what I've got. So, yeah, we'll just keep on defaulting there. Okay, so Ring of Bell, let's see. Let's see, we got, uh, what is it, Light Week on Tiz there. So actually, let's just, no wait, hold on. Yeah, you default, you dispel Earth Week, or Light Week, whatever it is. And, let's see, I don't need that, but let's see, let's go with Thundaga, and then, yeah, cure your own blindness there if I can, and let's see. Okay, let's cure blindness on Tiz. And hopefully they don't inflict it on me again already. Uh, let's see. Okay, some Fullman shards. And, yeah, that ought to be good. Oh, I forgot to inflict Lightning Week again. Not that that'll really matter at this point, but let's see. Okay, yeah, we've almost got the guy. Let's just go double Godspeed Strike. Um, actually, I only have enough MP for three Thundagas, but that should be fine. Okay, let's get a whole bunch of Giant Slayers going there. Just go all out at this point. Let's see, inflict Lightning Weak. And, let's see, a few Pantheon's Wraths. That should be more than enough to finish this guy off. Man, I thought this guy was going to be one of the easier ones. Well, I guess I don't need to inflict Lightning Week anymore. Hey, hey alright! Alright, just one more level to go, but yeah, as you can see with Tiz there, yeah, he needs 9,999 JP in order to master the freelancer job class to get that last level, job level. We won. Barely. You have defeated my guardian. Very well. I shall grant you the light keystone. Hey, all right. Not the same color as the dragon, but we'll take what we can get. All right. One more to go. But all right, can we defeat the toughest dragon of them all? Find out next time on Let's Play Bravely Default. This is H.G. Bailey, signing off. Have a good day.